Do you think with that kind of spacing we're going to be able to fit all of them in? In Sydney, Angela Wilson is one of the few full-time wedding planners in the country. It's her job to realise the bride's vision and make her princess for a day. To share the workload, Angela has a partner, her mother, Virginia. Just doing a little touch-up here on the wedding dress. So it is quite nerve-wracking. They need to be just touched up. Or maybe the problem is we're just perfectionists and we like to think it's done. If something goes wrong, I know she'll make the decision that I would make. So we, we work, we think very, 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 much very much alike. Very much alike. And I think our standard is, 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 the, is same. the same. Angela has been engaged to plan the wedding of Tracy and Shane, paid for by Tracy's mum and dad. Angela comes with all these young, fresh ideas for the theming, absolutely everything. I mean, we didn't have to worry about anything. She actually had it all under control and she gave us fantastic ideas. We didn't have to reinvent the wheel and look for names and contacts. She had them all on tap, basically. Most of my clients don't have time to really focus on too many components of the weddings, but I certainly encourage them to be a part of the planning process. We are spending a fair bit of money, you know, probably close to about $100,000. I work with a lot of high-end service providers and they know what I expect from them. I'm very happy with that. Oh, excellent. And the, the hems are all, all matching at the same yeah. length? Beautiful. Yeah, good. Wonderful. Are we ready to be a bride? Mm-hmm. Good. For those that don't have time, it's finding the venues, it's finding the photographers and videographers, the cars, helping with the dresses, helping finding the right earrings for the dresses, the shoes, the makeup artist and hairstylist. Arlene, can I get you in here now, please? The groom's suits and the flowers for them and finding the right shirts and the shoes for them, helping styling the mother of the bride and the mother of the, the groom, the fathers as well. I'm scared. Are you sure? I don't limit what I can provide. It's just really what that particular client wants me to provide. That's what I like to offer. OK, off you go. The ceremony will be finishing now and they'll be out the front of the church having the photos taken. And then the bridal party and the parents are going for the location shoot one. Then the guests will be making their way to Curzon Hall for the pre-drinks and canapes. I'm just heading back there now to make sure that the room's set up how it's supposed to be set up. Everyone loves to think that their guests have come to a wedding and they're seeing something for the first time rather than seeing the same band that was used at six of their family weddings. It's about finding the new and, and the fresh concepts and the new suppliers. So the families are, are kept entertained as well. Look at the beautiful place that we're going to have a reception at. It's like it looks like a castle. All the people from the state, they put them up in the motel. They had a dinner with us last night, which was absolutely beautiful. We had champagne and glasses in our room when we got back to the room. And I've just never been away and it was so um, dedicated to the guests who were coming to it. Everyone always wants a new theme or just to have a, a different vibe to the day. And I can do that. <laughs>